question number 4 construct an isosceles triangle whose base is 8 cm and the altitude is 4 cm and another triangle whose sides are one and half times the corresponding sides of the isosceles triangle okay observe the question let us write the data they are only mentioned that whose base is 8 cm so base is 8 cm altitude means height they have given altitude is 4 cm here we have to construct isosceles triangle isosceles triangle means as you all know two sides are equal we took so base is 8 cm altitude is 4 cm next what is the ratio they have given one and half so this is in mixed fraction 1 1 by 2 it is in mixed fraction you have to convert this into improper as you all know how to convert mixed fraction 2 1s are plus 1 2 1s are 2 2 plus 1 is 3 so 3 by 2 1 and half means 3 by 2 so now let us take base they have only mentioned that base 8 centimeter so let us take base 8 centimeter so name it as B C so this is 8 centimeter next to construct an isosceles triangle you have to draw perpendicular bisector as you all know how to draw the perpendicular bisector taking more than half more than half cutting an arc here no need to take downwards perpendicular bisector only you take upward so we got one x mark from there you draw one line to there so it became a perpendicular bisector we got here what is an altitude of that height it is 4 centimeter height it is 4 centimeter take 4 centimeter in your ruler then from this point only from this point you cut a arc so this is a point a this point so join a b and a c join a b and a c that means you got here these two sides are equal so this is isosceles triangle for this triangle we have to construct another triangle using the ratio yes now we got the ratio has we converted one and half into three by two which is the greatest number three so draw an acute angle same exact 45 degree so draw a ray you can take more than 45 or less than 45 but 45 is standard okay next which is the greatest number in this ratio 3 is the greatest number so make 3 parts in the ray so 1 cm each or you can take 2 cm also now uh, for smaller one here the ratios are small so you can go for 2 cm also so now I am taking 2 cm each so 1 2 3 here I am taking 2 cm each when the ratios are smaller you can take but when it is 7 by 5 7 by 6 if it, there are more parts then 1 cm is better so now let us name it as B1 B2 B3 for smaller number you can take 2 2 cm but for bigger one you can take 1 1 that's your wish one either prefer 1 cm or 2 cm don't go for 3 now which is the denominator here 2 so join B2 to C this one as I told you greater number parts denominator join sorry denominator join so here denominator is 2 so b2 join b2 next taking an arc from b2 exact 1 centimeter take 1 centimeter is enough for arc no need of taking 2 centimeter from b2 
cut an arc which touches both the lines from here to here again the numerator is b3 where you join from there you have to take an arc and numerator next measure these two these two and from here the line which the arc touches the line from there you cut an arc second we'll extend this arc because we want to get x mark so i'm extending this so we got one x mark here so from this x mark i'm going to extend this as till where i have to extend this line here you can look here if we draw like this it will come here exact so we'll extend this line also till where you have to extend till here so we'll extend as i told you if numerator is greater then it will come outside this point so other remaining will arise it so name it as c dash c dash next step is same 1 cm from c from c where you will get two lines you cut an arc from here to here from c dash same arc next measure these two same from this point the line which touches from this point cut an arc you got on x point so from that x point go upwards towards c a okay got like this and extend this line extend this line you got a dash look here this is the triangle which we got now we got bigger triangle a dash so same again the same step a dash b c dash is a required triangle bandidu required triangle therefore triangle a dash b c dash is similar to triangle a b c so this is enough clear here i took 2 2 cm because the ratios are very small so i took if you take 3 cm you will get like this when you are drawing it will be little bit confusion so i took 2 2 cm if ratios are bigger you can take only 1 1 so only you prefer 1 cm or 2 cm don't go for more than 2 clear so this is about question 